Hey guys, what's up? This is Barber Town, and welcome back to another Dragon Ball Z Doken Battle video. So, the time has come. It is time for our final Gogeta summon. I've been saving up, and as of today, I finally have enough tickets to do my last Gogeta summon. Do you that have been around? You would have seen that we would have been given five as part of the login campaign kind of thing, or the countdown to this celebration. And we were given one today if you've logged in for all seven days as part of this celebration so far. And then you can also go and buy the first pack in the in the um, stone shop. I think it's like three pound fifty nine, at least UK prices. Um, you can go and buy that, and that'll give you four more tickets. So overall, it gives you the ten that you need. Um, so, on this stream, we'll, we, we will be doing our last Gogeta summon. Uh, how good it's going to be, um, obviously, fingers crossed we get it. I'm not too optimistic, because if you weren't there for the last summon video, we got pretty shafted, I want to say. I think we spent eight or 900 stones, and um, yeah, we didn't really get near to where we wanted to be. <laughs> we didn't get... I think the only unit new to me that I pulled was the Tech Gen Ember, and I only got one of him in like one of my last summons. So, um, yeah, not massively optimistic, but a summon is a summon. So if we get him, I will be buzzing. <laughs> um, anyway, I'll save that for the end of the stream, or for when we've got a few more people. Maybe people want to do a group summon and that kind of thing. We'll hold off on that. The other thing that I wanted to do as part of this stream was go into the God of Destruction event. Now, I've touched in this once already, I think, this content. I think I did the first stage. Um, if we just jump in and we'll go and have a look. Uh, there we are. God of Destruction event. So we would have done um, Ivan. Uh, we'll move on to Hellas now. So if I remember rightly, um, Hellas is the type changer. Um, let's go and actually have a look. So it looks like I used, what would that be, a Boo Saga team. Blue Saga slash Battle of Wits. I wouldn't have thought that that team's going to have changed too much from when I last ran it. Um, Blue Saga. Where's Battle of Wits? Where is Battle of Wits? There it is. Um, so, essentially, I'm, what I'm looking for here is what units might I not have included before that I might be able to use now. Um, JJ the Necker, okay, so it was probs a dumb choice, but for my Pronga wish, I went gift cards, statues and stuff, and potential orbs. And with the two gift cards, I got two dupes of STR Topo to unlock his last groups. I mean, first off, welcome to the chat again, JJ. Secondly, I legit forgot about Pronga. I haven't done the, the last Dragon Ball, so I can do that on stream as well. Thank you so much for reminding me. And, uh... Yeah, thirdly, you went for Topo. <laughs> um, use a Dende. Oh, sweet. Well, well, in fact, we'll hold off on the God of it, and we'll just jump into an event stage. And, yeah, we'll go use a Dende. Um, and then we can do the Paranga live on stream. That'll be pretty cool. Um, if I remember rightly, I was collecting these um, crappy Videls because for whatever reason I didn't get her done. Uh, and it's a stored events category. Here, isn't it? Um, and you went. You decided to go for Topo. Um, you get three wishes, so you said you went for gift cards, Kai's, and potential orbs. So I oh know. So gift cards, statues. So that's Zenny. Um, and potential orbs. I mean, I, I definitely would have got the Kai's. Um, Kai's over Zenny. Zenny's reasonably easy to get um, just by doing um, easy A's and that kind of thing. Um, so yeah, I, I'm surprised you would have gone for um, gone for those, but it's up to you, man. Um, I'm honestly not too sure. I, I'm not sure I'd go for the gift cards myself because I've, I've had a quick look through, and there wasn't much value for me there, to be honest. I had most units, I think, rainbowed or like I, I didn't need them. Um, what have you spent your other gift cards on? Because we've had other gift cards throughout the celebration. Have you just did you only have two in total, and you went put them both on Topo? Or did you get two for doing the uh, Paranga? Oh, I just realised I did not put it in the end. <laughs> uh, yeah, what did you use your other gift cards on? 
I think I grabbed one other. I forget. <laughs> yeah, I mean, there's actually loads of good units on there that you can choose from, though, isn't there? So there's loads of um, probably quite newly easy aid units. Um, even if they're not newly easy aid units, you can get things like I've seen the golden freezers. Um, I haven't. I've been indecisive as to who I want to actually buy, so I've still got my gift card sat there as well. Um, maybe that's something else we could do on the stream as well. Um, actually spend the gift cards, and I might just let the community decide who I buy, uh, assuming that they're not rainbowed already. But yeah, thank you for reminding me about all this, man. Um, I logged into Doken this morning, and I did um, some... What was it? I did... I used all my boost bars, grounded some links on 23.8, and then, yeah, just left it. I've been pretty busy today, so I haven't had as much of a chance as I would have wanted to. Um, so, honestly, Purunga completely slipped my mind. So, yeah, thank you so much for reminding me about it, man. Um, aside from that, how was your day? Have you had a good day so far, mate? Yes, I have. What have you been up to then? Um, I came back from the cinema maybe an hour or so ago. Um, it was, I got to watch Venom last week, and essentially it was the missus' turn to have a choice. And we both regretted her choice. We went to go watch something about bloody Princess Diana. Um, yeah, I, I would not recommend it if you're based in the UK. I'm not sure if it's out in like the US and around the world. There's a new film in the cinema about Princess Diana, and don't go watch it. <laughs> And I forgot to even use the bloody Dende. What is going on? I've got a brain like a sieve today. Um, are you going to be doing the uh, Princess Who? <laughs> um, Princess Diana. So uh, it depends whereabouts in the world if you've heard of it. Um, but you know we've got like the Queen uh, and her son Prince Charles. Um, Prince Charles, so our future king married um diana years ago and is like the mum to the other like to the other heirs of the throne uh william um but she like there's this whole massive drama essentially i think really only brits care about it um yeah there's whole this whole conspiracy that the crown um killed this princess because she just didn't get on with the rest of the crown and she had all these different thoughts and stuff and that's what we thought the film was going to be like. We thought, oh, it's going to, it's, it might be all right, actually. Uh, we'll give it the benefit of the doubt and turn up. <laughs> and it was absolutely awful. So, yeah, probably not something that you care too much about. But, um, yeah, if you're a Brit and you're, you're looking for a film to see, uh, go see anything. But, but don't go see this, uh, this Princess Diana film. It's, it's not worth it. And that is the den they used. So, give me my last Paronga ball and let me make that wish. Um, laptop, you good. Is everything alright? Can you hear me? Or is your laptop broken? It randomly started beeping. Um... I can't hear it on my end. Is it... Is it still there? Then the blue stacks crashed. Oh, yours! You you really made me jump then, because I'm, I've had all sorts of sound and audio issues, so I've been trying to update the stream, essentially, and give it all sorts of backgrounds, and um, moving from mobile streaming to streaming on my, la on my laptop, and I've had all sorts of issues, so you, you crapped me up then. Is your laptop okay though? You're not gonna, it's not going to like imminently blow up or anything like that. <laughs> I like that little bunny emote. Uh, yeah, well, it's, it's literally been a learning curve. That's why I haven't been streaming too much the last kind of couple of days because I'm trying to get this all down. I think it's okay. Well, is it smoking? That's that's probably the question. Munchlax. Oh, is that a munchlax? I didn't even realize. I just saw the two ears. Um, no, fair play. Um, where did you get that from? If I hover over, it, tell me who you got it from. Blue Boy Blankies. Oh, that's a pretty cool emote. I like that. Um, are you ready? So what is it? What, what do you chant? I suppose this is Namekian chant to um, activate this Shenron. But the, the Super Shenron is what, like, carrots and peas, carrots and peas, or something like that. 
Uh, let's summon Shenron, though. It's probably this, this will be the second time you've seen this today. I'll have to, I, I, I'm not even sure what, wishes, what the wishes are. I think one of them I can get meat. So I'll be definitely be getting the Kai's. I'll definitely be getting the meat. So I can select three. I want a full belly. Um, I'll be getting another set. So yeah, I think we get another set as part two. It's part of part two. Um, I know JP got two sets, um, but I'm not sure if they're back to back. So it'd be a case of seeing tomorrow whether whether there's another ball for us to collect. But it, I, I think it's part two that we'll get the other set. So the answer is yes. I'm just not sure when. <laughs> Um, I'm not fast about training items. And I think I'm tempted to get keys, just from where I do a lot of Super Battle Road content and stuff like that. That'll probably be quite helpful for me. I'm not fussed about the gift cards. Um, get keys that open up portals. Yeah, I'll, I'll take the keys, I think. Oh, it's reset everything. We'll take the meat, we'll take the keys, and we'll take the Kai's. Especially with all the heroes units coming up soon, um, there'll be all sorts of use for these guys. You'll have what um, Janemba as well, who hopefully we get. But always luck of the draw with uh, the top banners. Um, I'm still hoping we get what Super Vegeta before Christmas as well. Um, and then we've got the Christmas kind of step up banner or Christmas slash New Year's step up banner. It's weird that that's less than two months away. So. If you think back to last year, if you wanted to do all the steps of the step up banner, you needed 600 stones. And just looking at my stone count at the moment, it's uh, yeah, a bit of saving to do. Paragon till death, yo, Barwood Town and Neko. Uh, hey, Paragon, how you doing, mate? You good? Um, thankfully, JJ or Neko rather realized, uh, reminded me I hadn't done Paranga today. Um, I didn't get the last Dragon Ball, so we've literally just gone and done that. <laughs> Um, have you got Paranga done as well? Paragon, yeah, fine, thanks. Good to hear, man. Good to hear you keeping well. Let's go claim all these things. So three Kai's of every type, I'll take. I like those keys. Uh, those keys will definitely come in handy for some of the content I'm going to be doing. And all the meat. Great, that means everyone's going to be smashing the next World Tournament out as well. That's just what everyone saves their meat up for, is just so they can smash World Tournament. Um... Anyway, I, I yeah, I'm going to go back to the original content before I got distracted and realised how I'd forgotten about some of the most important content at the moment. Let's go back to the God of it. Um, so we were on to Hellas and we were having a look at um, what team we could run. It was probably going to be a Boo Saga slash Battle of Wits team. Um, I'll take the rainbow one. So that's the team I used last time. Um, Paragon, yeah, I got mine this morning. Meat, orbs, and kai's. Yeah, I went similar. I went for meat, kai's, and keys. Orbs, while useful, I've got loads of them, and a lot of my units are rainbowed, so I was just like, well, I'm not going to use them, like, anytime soon. Like, every, everyone I need is rainbowed, unless I, like, literally pull loads of new units that I, that I need to invest in. I, I should be fine. Um... So this team's already better, so from the my Gogeta summons, my Gotenks is up to three dupes, I think, now, after i pulled two of him. And my Pycon, I think, is up to two dupes. So this team, from when I last beat this event, is already better than where it was. Um, we'll go see if there is any way I can improve on it, though. I think I've already got Boo Saga and Battle of Wits selected. So yeah, we'll go and have a look and see if there are any other units that I might be able to bring. Um... Neko, I went gift cards, Zenny, and Orbs. Yeah, so that's what um, Neko went for. For the gift cards, he spent them on a couple of copies of STR Topo, just to make sure that he was rainbowed. Um, STR Topo, really good unit. Um, but yeah, each everyone's got their own account, haven't they, at the end of the day. And what works for one person might not work for someone else. So, I mean, as long as it bettered your account at the end of the day, um, that's what's important. So having a look here, so I suppose I've got Boo Tanks I could look to bring. I didn't have him when I last did this run. Um, I'm not sure how I change it. Oh, I've just heard a... <laughs> so I've just heard it. You might be able to see little tails on the screen. Um, so thank you, Omar, for following. I... 
That is the first time that we've actually been able to see that little animation. So I was buzzing that someone's just triggered it. <laughs> what did you guys think of it? Or is it just me being an absolute kid that saw Tails come on? Um, Omar, welcome to the stream, man. Welcome to the town. How are you? I didn't see it. Oh, no. <laughs> um, yeah, wow. I'm hoping it's not just me. It did come up on my screen. But yeah, as I say, I've, I've made the move over to stream from the laptop now, trialing to see how it goes. And um, yeah, it's one of the little things that like, you can amend, like the, the follow animations and all that kind of thing. So I've had a little play with that. Um, but yeah, hopefully we'll get another follower on the channel and we can all go see it again. <laughs> Um, Paragon, hey Omar, thanks for following my boy. Yeah, thanks for the follow, Omar. I definitely appreciate it. Hopefully you like the content and stick around. Um, is that another Munchlax emoji or oh, emote? Um, Omar, I'm fine. How about you? Yes, I'm good, thank you, man. I'm even better because, thankfully, JJ or Neko, I always get everyone's names mixed up. Um, Neko has just reminded me about the Paranga Dragon Balls, which I'd actually completely forgotten about today. So we've just gone and summoned Paranga. Um, we've got Kai's, Keys, and Meat, and we're jumping back into the God event, and we're going to try and take on Hellas, and we're going to absolutely smash it in a really kind of PG way. <laughs> oh, Jesus. We've just been absolutely spammed with Munchlax. Is that your favourite Pokemon by any chance? Um, but yeah, Omar, obviously first new newcomer to the stream. Um, I love hearing about people's summons and stuff. How were your Gogeta summons? I'm assuming you might have put a couple into him. Um, honestly, I'm looking at this team. I'd, I'd be tempted to try and bring a Roshi in to get his, the best out of his revive, but there aren't really that many like Turtle School units that I'd bring that, that would be able to stand up to this. Um, really, you'd only be looking at Gokus, and there's what? The Int Super Saiyan 2 one, um, the AGL EZA. There isn't really like a good standalone Goku at the moment from here. I'm just looking at it, like, from the Boo Saga, I don't think there's, like, a decent Super Saiyan 3 Goku. Obviously, we've got this guy's EZA dropping soon. Um, that'll be a, quite a big buff. Um, Omar, I'm on JP Dogen. Fair play. Um, I'm trying to think of who was out there at the moment. Did you do any summons on Trunks? Um, I think we will just jump in on this team, actually. Just, just to refresh our memory, see how we go. In terms of support memory, I might leave that blank as well. Um... And just see how we go, whether we actually need to use it. Again, this team's already been buffed from when I last used it. Just because I've got extra dupes in Gotenks and Pycon. Um, we've also got a Rainbow Vegito, or a Rainbow Vegito friend, so that's definitely going to come in handy. Um, mine is Gumi, so I'm just having a look through there. Oh, your favourite Pokemon is Gumi. Why Gumi of all Pokemon? I'm curious. Um... JJ, I meant that is another Munchlax emote. <laughs> uh, Omar, I summon on Trunks. I got him twice now. I'm farming the Entrusted Wheel category. I haven't had too much of a look at the Entrusted Wheel category. Is it quite a runnable category? Like, what kind of units are on it? Like, is it all Trunkses or I'm trying to think of what else could be on there? Um, yeah, share with us. Like, what kind of units have you got on the team? Um, JJ the Neko, the in unit SA one. Adele's feelings, never mind, it's a beam. <laughs> um, which which uh, unit was that? I've probably clicked past it. I, I always struggle keeping chat and the phone, like keeping attention on both. I'm either focusing on what's going on on the phone and then ignoring chat, or I focus on chat and die on the phone. Um, the Super Saiyan 3 Goku. Yeah, so I do like that unit, um, but we don't really have very many just plain old Super Saiyan 3. So we've got the Super Saiyan 3 Angel, but we don't have a, like a Super Saiyan 3 Goku that fights Kid Buu, I don't think. The super, the tech Super Saiyan 3 has a halo over his head, so he would have been fighting Fat Buu. Um, unless it's just me and I've missed something. Um, let's have a look here. So we'll put Gohan slot 1. Um, probably try and float Vegito off here. Um, I don't... I'm not Definitely not using an item this early. Um... Hopefully Gohan's the one that gets supered, if we're going to get supered at all. Uh, we'll just jump in here. Hopefully that... I'm scared that... Oh, now we're fine. We're getting supered with, with Gohan. Uh, 169k, though. That's still a lot, man. <laughs> um, Omar, not a bad category. It's a stacking one. 
Oh, what? So there's quite a lot of stackers on the team. Yeah, what other kind of characters are there, though? So, as I say, I suppose you've got a lot of trunks. Um, I suppose you might have, like, future Gohans, because they entrust the will. Um, yeah, I'm trying to think of what other what other units might be on the category. Um, yeah, we've taken not too much damage there. Um, depends on the next rotation, but I might need to use a Princess Snake a lot earlier, earlier than I would have wanted. Uh, it'd be great if this Vegito could get some crits in, though. I can't remember what the STR Vegito's transformation is. I think it's like you can't use him till turn four at the uh, at the earliest anyway. Um, with the unit super attack with Hercule after the deactivating. Oh yeah, I remember that one. So yeah, he goes into he goes from Super Saiyan three down to base, doesn't he? And um, that's is that a free to play one, I think. Okay, so what does he type? What does she change type into? Oh, I'm, I'm so rusty with these. So she's turned into tech, so probably best to keep Pycon off rotation here then. In terms of defense, we're not looking too bad. I want to get Pycon some orb. Oh. I want to get everyone some orbs. Um, Pycon, I ideally wanted to try and get him a rainbow key sphere, because then he'd get his dodge, uh, which I think he's going to need. So we'll pick up those orbs. And... We'll get the unit super attack with Python, but by getting the rainbow key sphere, um, it means we're not going to get the support type buff that we could have got by, by Python by just getting three normal key spheres. Um, I'd say it's worth it at the end of the day, though, for getting his chance to dodge at the end. Um, should not should be okay. Again, it depends where the super's coming from, or well, we're taking a lot of damage from normals as it is. Um... Omar, Tech Gohan is there, Pycon, so some pretty good units then. I mean, it sounds like a reasonably runnable character, uh, runnable category. Um, it's definitely good that you've got him though. You can guarantee there's going to be like a Super Battle Road or some mission for like the GT Goku event or the Vegeta event or something like that that needs this Trunks team to do it. So definitely glad you've got him, man. And Trunks is like one of the, it's always the new Doku best, always tends to be one of the better units in the game. So the fact that you've got him is definitely a good thing, man. Um, JJ, maybe Piccolo because he raised Gohan. Yeah, oh, entrusted his will to him, maybe? Um, what's the easiest God of Destruction stage? Uh, that's a tough one, actually. Well, we'll try and go through a couple as part of this stream so you can make up your, your own mind from watching. Um, I don't think any of them are easy. It's a probably a crap answer. I'd say Ivan... He's STR type, so there's loads of AGL units that you can kind of bring with you there that will do a bit of damage. So I, I might say Ivan. It, it tends to not be the God of Destruction, but more their typing. So Hellas is quite hard because she changes types. But say, I think there's a physical one. Is it Moscow? Moscow is quite hard because he super attacks all allies, so you just need to try and dodge it. Um, Archie jumps in in the chat. They're all easy. Just does that little flex there. I like to see it. <laughs> Definitely not all easy though, so if you are struggling JJ, genuinely don't worry. Um, yeah, we're definitely going to have to use a Princess Snake here. Um, thankfully, if we do take any more damage this turn, we will just transform next turn, so it's not the end of the world. Um, should be fine this turn. We'll have to miss a super attack with um, Goku and Vegeta. But again, really not the end of the world. At least we've got some AGL key spheres there, so looking all right. Um, JJ, I tried the U1 one. So is that the Ivan one? The, uh, the, I think Ivan is the little fluff ball, isn't he? Um, STR type. Um, Archie coming in hot with the jokes. <laughs> hey, man. Um, I couldn't get past turn one yet. Yeah. It's so, the, like, the God of Event, even now, so what, it's been out, I know it's been out longer for Omar on uh, on JP, but um, on on Global, it's been out for us with, for what, four, five months, and it's still really hard. <laughs> like, you've got to have some of the new characters, like, for some of these, like, you literally have to have, like, Tech go on. Uh, one unit I completely forgot about bringing, though, was Tech Khalifla. She probably would have been quite helpful for this stage, but I just kind of went with what I bought last time. Um, but yeah, if you can't get past turn one, don't worry, man. Um, at the end, it just means, like, I wish I was in the position you are, but still having content to get done. So, don't worry about it. 
just keep cracking away and eventually you'll find a couple months down the line or oh, I'll go give it a go and you'll just breeze past it um, how are we looking here so sweet we can get a transformation we will take that and um, that'll give us a full heal and it all really good for this turn especially it will let us know when we're getting super attacked so I know where to put um, AGL Vegito as we know he counters so it's all about his crit counters and he is quite susceptible to a super attack even though he's got type advantage, you'll probably still take a fair bit of damage. So, uh, yeah, I'm pretty happy that we've been able to trigger this transformation as we have. Uh, yeah, of course she's a super attacking slot one. Um, I'm tempted to leave him there, you know, because it's not the... He'll get hit first, so he'll gain some sort of attack anyway. Uh, some sort of defense. And then he's got type advantage, which I'm going to kind of rely on a little bit. Um, we'll take that. They should be linked up fairly well, and I'm going to save all those in orbs um, for future rotations. It'd be nice to have the key later. Um, interesting to see how much suits damage the super attack does. Um, Archie, Quatella is traditionally the easiest, uh, whatever her name is. Uh, Quatella's the mouse one, isn't it? So, is that the one you meant? Um, at JJ, weirdly, I can't remember which was easiest, but I seem to remember Beerus only taking one attempt. Yeah, like, it's been so long since I've gone through this content. It's one of the reasons why I wanted to do this video and just kind of, obviously, some people have struggled with it in the past. And, um, yeah, I thought we'd jump in, see how hard it was, and see if any of the new units might be helpful. So I think it is Catella who Archie's mentioned. I think he's one of the tech enemies. So I'm looking forward to seeing how, like, the um, new LR Super Saiyan Goku had holds up in that. I reckon he's going to be pretty good with his defensive stack. But yeah, obviously, depending on how, how Hellas goes, if we can beat her, we'll see what the next one's like. We'll just keep kind of keep going through it. Um, I, can't, I don't remember Beerus being too hardy either, now that you say that, Paragon. Um, there's a couple that I one t I one shot it. Like, I did it in one turn. Not one turn, but I did it in kind of one attempt. Um, but I can't remember what they are off the top of my head. And Omar, it's time to get my entrusted wheel category in um, Legendary Goku Event GT. Are oh, you going to do that now, are you? Um, good luck, man. Um, keep us updated with how you're going. I'm quite interested. I I haven't seen too much of the trunks. I haven't seen his details. I, I've seen his details, but I haven't seen too much gameplay of him. Um, I'll be interested to hear on how he holds up in the last stage of the event against that tech enemy. And whether he'll ha whether he'll get slapped about or whether he'll be all right. Yeah, keep us up to date. Let us know. Um, also, let us know what you think of the trunks, how he performs just in general. Um, obviously, it's going to be kind of six months away for us on global. Um, I think a lot of the a lot of my followers are global only. So um, yeah, let us know if you reckon he's a skip or a summon. I I'd like to think he's a summon. Um, looking here, so we can get another Vegito transformation, and we can see that we're not getting super attacked in that first slot. Um, I, pro I might even use an item here. I reckon we can absolutely smash this Hellas for damage. This Vegito is going to have type advantage. He's going to be only taking normal attacks, so he's just going to be countering everywhere. I think mine's got a fair bit of crit as well. So, um, yeah, I think I might just use the Princess Snake and Blitz him. I think that'll be the way to go. Use the Princess Snake. Do we gamble with Gohan's transformation as well so we get super effective against all types? Ah, screw it. Let's see the art. Let's, let's go do it. Um, we'll try and get Pycon's um, support type ability as well, just to give them all a little bit more of a kick. Um, JJ, are they planning to prove... Uh, are they trying to prevent nuking by banning orb changes? Um, for this event, I think they are. Honestly, it's been so long. Um, I... I don't think it's the orb changes they ban. I think it's the um, nuking leaders that they ban. So you can't bring, like, um, the Tech Super Saiyan Blue Goku as an example. I think they were the ones um, that you couldn't bring. So let's get all those orbs there. We'll get all these orbs as well. And, yeah, I think we can get Pycon su support type ability as well. Smashed it. So I'm interested to see how much damage this Vegito is doing. I think my Vegito's got two or three dupes. So double digits there. Um, no crit here. But I think if we get some crits from these counties, he's taking, what, five attacks? So if we can get two or three crits out of them, um, we'll be sitting quite pretty, to be honest. That's one crit. So that's done, what, half a, half a health bar. Um, Archie, difficulty is relative. Depends on your box. 
it's not necessarily, I suppose, yeah, it depends on your box, but even like doing the corroded body and mind um, mission on the GT Goku event, like, yeah, like, I've got I've got a decent box, but that was still really hard for me. And same with Connected Hope, even though you've got PyCon, I still really struggled with that mission. So sometimes the missions are just genuinely assholes. Um, Archie, at JJ, you can one-shot almost all of the gods with GT Kid Goku. Can you actually? I suppose it depends if you can get him set up, but I suppose if he's, if he's got tight disadvantage and that kind of thing, I can imagine actually struggling. Okay, so PyCon might get slapped at the end there. I, I'm glad we've got... Um, I'm glad we've got his uh, support type giving him a little bit more defense. I'm glad we've got the snake active as well. We're down to, what, one bar of health? Is this a double super? Yeah, double super. So he'll raise his defense twice as well, which will be helpful for us. Um, NJ, yo, NJ in the chat. Hey, NJ, how you been, mate? Have you had a good day? How much damage is this doing? 200k? I'll, I'll take that. So reversing back to AGL. Um, we can thankfully still see where all the supers are. If we'd have taken a little bit more damage there, we would have um, been okay to get the int transformation as well. Um, yeah, I, I think we should be all right here, to be honest. We're not getting super attacked. We know that from transforming with Vegito. Um, it's all about how much damage we take from the normals. But between all these guys here... Yeah, double digits. Yeah, we're fine this turn. Um, I'd like to think that Hellas is dead. To be honest, I think the G, I think STR Vegito will wipe the floor with her. Um, Archie, yup. Uh, NJ, a cool new layout for the stream. Yeah, appreciate that, man. Um, I've been working the last couple of days on it. It's not perfect by all counts. Um, it's still got a little bit of tweaking, but uh, yeah, I've tried to move from streaming off my phone to streaming on um on my laptop. Um, so yeah, literally started from scratch, didn't know what I was doing, so it's taken a little bit of time, um, but if you guys have feedback, I'm certainly going to take it on board, and this is kind of like version one, um, but I'll stick with this for a little bit, see how it holds up, and then uh, I'll constantly be trying to make amendments. Um, we do have a little new um, follow animation as well, which we did see earlier when Omar started following, so thank you to Omar, because I was actually really excited to see that little animation. Um, but uh, but yeah, um, onwards and upwards, and it will only get better from here. So yeah, thanks for noticing that, NJ. Really appreciate it. Archie, I did it for two of them for fun. What you just built up the kid, go uh, the GT kid Goku, and just smacked them about. <laughs> um, that is Hellas dead though. So we didn't really struggle too much. Um, so if those of you that haven't beaten Hellas, and you might have some of the units that I've used. Um, we'll go back and uh, I'll show you the team again to, that I used just to recap. But yeah, I, I didn't really struggle against Hellas then. I probably got a bit lucky on the tur on the turns and things. I think we did, what, three bars of damage um, against the physical version. So um, yeah, that, that that's Hellas beaten. So again, just to recap, um, I'll try and find another friend one as well. So that's the team that we used. Um, I... A lot of these units are reasonably old now. I think a lot of people have got the Goku and Vegeta, uh, the Vegito STR Vegito unit. A lot of people are going to have the three-year LR um, Vegito. I think everyone's got the AGL one, and then the the Gohan's been about for a year or so. And Gotenks and Polycon are on the Gogeta banner, so a lot of people should have pulled them as well. So, um, so yeah, that's the team that I used. I'd like to think a lot of people have got them done. It might take you a couple runs, but um, but yeah, you've just seen from the from that run through that it certainly is possible um nj oh, i just realized i can hear the game sound now so that's actually a little workaround it's not actually the game sound but i managed to download a couple of osts and um yeah so i've just got like the osts playing on loop in the background um i still couldn't couldn't figure out how to get my game audio across i probably will figure out how to get it but I figured just having an OST in the background is just better than silence. So, um, yeah, I'm, I'm glad you're picking up on all these things, man. It makes it worth going through the effort to figure out how to do it. Um, Omar, when my trunk's transformed and he has 400k defense. Mate, that's... Uh, mate, that's nuts. Like, that make, that's one of the best, better defensive units in the game. Fair play. Um, Paragon, Barwatown, I know you haven't asked specifically, but the gameplay is running smooth. I appreciate that, man. As I say, the the mirroring app that I'm using has a little quirk to it. So, 
Um, I literally have to have the mirror open. So whilst I've got like my streaming thing up, the um, the mirror device. If I minimise the mirror device, it removes the game capture from the stream, which is really annoying. But equally, like if I just click off it for any reason, um, it goes really buggy and really slow. So I've literally kind of got like I'm see as well as my phone the stream and I've got like a third version of my phone on the computer so I'm like seeing treble of what I'm doing <laughs> but it's running smooth thank you so much I'm glad of, I'm so glad about it is um JJ have you beaten the first one yes so I beat the first one on a previous stream I can go back and do it for you I suppose it makes sense if we're doing it as part of the stream um yeah so I suppose if that's one you're having trouble with let's go and show you the team that I used to beat that um Paragon Omar, nice. Yeah, I mean, 400k defense for a Trunks. Um, how many of those Trunkses did you pull, Omar? Is that him at 55%, or have you got him? Um, have you got a dupe or two in him as well? Um, JJ, I'd like to see what you used. Yeah, by all means, let's go and have a look. Um, so looks like it was a Goku's family um, slash Kamehameha. So yeah, so you've. I've done it since I got the Kid Gohan as well. So yeah, what is it? Goku's family and then just a Tech Khalifa. So yeah, we'll, we'll jump in with this team and we'll try and take on this one as well for the people that haven't kind of seen this this run get done or they've struggled, they might have some of the units. Um, JJ, have you got some of these units? Do you reckon this might be a, a possible team for you? I know the Gohan, the Kid Gohan might be, um, might be out of some people's reach because obviously it's quite a brand new unit. Um, but yeah, let me know if you've got some of these units as well. Um, Omar, I'm on the Great Ape stage now. Uh, I've got the trunks at 79%, so what's that? Two dupes? Fair play, man. Um, he shouldn't have any problems with the Great Ape stage with type advantage. What kind of... You said he's hit 400k defense. What kind of attack numbers is he putting up? Archie, have you beaten them all? Yeah, I've got them all beaten, Archie. Um... Yeah, I, beat, I was beating them all kind of as they came out. It might have taken me a couple of, of attempts just to kind of work a team out. But yeah, they all got beaten. Um, they all got knocked down and they have not gotten back up again. I haven't gone back through them though, like until I've started doing these streams. Um, JJ, no. Um, uh, Archie, I assume yes. <laughs> um, yes, uh, Archie, I have got them, got them all beat. Um, JJ, I only have the Super Saiyan 4 Goku. Um, out of these, so I'm surprised you wouldn't have like the Gohan. Um, he's been out of it, the um, Super Saiyan Gohan. Um, he's been out a little while. Kale and Khalif, they're, they're, they're a what a legendary banner, a legendary summon banner unit. So I can understand people not having them. Um, yeah, I definitely dig around and check if you've got Tech Khalifa. Tech Khalifa is really kind of useful for these runs. Um, but we'll jump in. Well, I'm not even going to have a look. I, I, I'll jump in with this team. Since we last did this, I think I've got like an extra dupe or two in Kale and Khalifa. So we'll just let them go ham. Um, the Gohan should, the kid Gohan should take care of himself as well. Um, Source the Prime. Sup? How are y'all doing, famo? We are doing good, Source. How are you doing, mate? Are you having a good day? I know you stream as well, so Source does a little bit of um, streaming for Doken as well. So if any if anyone sees him online, by all means go check him out. Um, yeah, I've I've tuned in a couple of times for him as well. So um, yeah, definitely go give Source a check. Omar, attack is 240k. Do you mean like 2.4 mil? Source the Prime is now hosting my stream with one viewer. Thank you, Source. Um, that is one little animation that I needed to amend. It's just a kind of default little zombie, but. Uh, either way, I still quite like seeing that. So yeah, thanks, uh, thanks, Source. I really appreciate that, man. Um, I got Super Gogeta and Goku Angel and Vegeta. Um, I'm trying to think which Goku Angel and Vegeta Angel you mean there. Oh, is that that's just the tech one in general. Uh, JJ the Neko is also hosting the stream with one viewer. Cheers, guys! I mean, getting all the views in. Just love. I just love seeing all the little animations, and when I when I hear like the little sound that comes up, my ears kind of perk up, and I'm like, "Oh, what's that? Oh, sh oh shit, it's me! <laughs> what's going on?" Um, Archie, gotta go. Have a great stream, laters chat, laters Archie. Thanks so much for tuning in, mate. Dropping by and chatting, um, it really does mean a lot. So yeah, thanks Archie. Um, I'll let you know in the Discord what we managed to pull from our summon. Um, Source the Prime. I'm good. Thanks, bro. Um, yeah, good to hear that you're doing well. Glad that you managed to get the Gogeta and the Goku and Vegeta. 
Um, fingers crossed I'll be able to get them to today as well. As I said at the beginning of the stream, I've got enough tickets to do one final, 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 because I'm not putting stones in, one final Gogeta summon. And I really want this Gogeta, so it all kind of hinges on this as to whether we get him or not. Um, so I'm going to be saving that probably towards the end of the stream, you know, like just keep you all guessing, um, keep you all interested. But yeah, it was literally going to be the last summon on Gogeta that I'm going to do on this banner. So fingers crossed we can get him. Um, let's have a look at initial defense stats. So the Gohan's probably going to take a little bit of damage turn one, but we can kind of expect that. Um, Kale and Khalifla, the girls, you know, they, they just, they take care of themselves really, don't they? Um, and we don't have to worry about Khalifla at the end, so I'm just going to leave all those nice shiny AGL orbs there for us to pick up. Um, definitely looking forward to picking them up. Um, Source the Prime, hey, hope you're well, man. Oh, I love that you guys are being so nice to each other. Um, 24k Zelda thick, yo, what's good? Hey, Zelda, we're good here, man. Just doing the God event. Um, did the Paronga Dragon Balls earlier on as well, and we'll be ending the stream with a summon as well. So, pretty jam-packed stream, man. Um, how are you doing, man? You good? I forgot Ivan Dodges. <laughs> um, he's a little asshole, isn't he? Um, letting the girls just go go loose. So where Ivan is, uh, Universe Survival Saga enemy. Um, I'm pretty sure Kaelin Khalifa to get an extra super attack in them. Um, look, they're already taking double digits. Uh, yeah. I, I do love Kaelin Khalifa. So I've only got two like uh, legendary summon banner LRs actually rainbowed. One is like in Bojack, who's hopefully getting his easy A, because I'm, I'm just hyped to use so I love that Bojack. Um, and the other is Kale and Khalifla, so if there is an LR to have had rainbowed, I'm glad it's Kale and Khalifla, because they're just solid. Um, I can see we're getting super attacked a lot in that first slot, and I, even though I know that they're not going to link, I'm probably going to do this, just so that I know that the Goku can do go away and dodge it all. Um, we might have to miss super attacks with the Gohan, which I'm not super hyped about. Um, I don't think there's any way I can kind of get around it either. So we've got one with that go on. Um, we'll just try and bring Key down for other turns. Not an ideal turn there, but I, hopefully Goku either gets hit a couple of times with normal so we can trigger his um, revive. Um, or he at least gets supered so we can dodge it as well. Um... Everyone being nice to Zelda, yeah, I, I generally love like the little community we books. Everyone's just so nice to each other. I haven't come across any toxicity um, from, from my experience of streaming. So, yeah, I'm glad everyone's being nice. Uh, Shade X, huh? First time chat. Welcome to the stream, Shade. So if I remember yesterday, you were watching um, Brother Jams' Pokemon stream yesterday. And that's how you came across the channel. So welcome to the channel, man. Glad to have you here. Are you having a good day? Um, Zelda, I summoned yesterday and I got LR Super Saiyan Blue Kaioken Goku and Super Saiyan Blue Evolution Vegeta. And I got second duplicate of Festival featured by Goten and Trunks. I, I'm, I don't even have them, so um, so you've just name dropped two units that I'm missing. So not I'm not bitter at all. I am not bitter, I promise. Uh, and you also got AGL Pycon. Is that your first copy of Pycon at all? Um, really good unit. Um, crucial for the Connected, Pod, uh, connected Hope uh, mission for the GT Goku event. So, yeah, really good summon there, man. Um, let's have a look. So, Kale and Khalifa are slot one. Um, I actually have to remind myself, what is this Go Gohan's active skill? It's flashing and I want to hit it. Uh, recovers 30% HP, guards all attacks and raises allies... Defense. Um, yeah, damn right, we're going to use that. <laughs> Just seeing what our health is. We'll take a 30% heal, we'll take the guard, and we'll take improving everyone's defense by 20% for two turns. And not just that, I'll take seeing the art. Like, we will take this all day. Um, defense check now. Uh, Kel and Khalifa, 200k, we'll take that. Uh, Kid Go, 144k as well. And everyone should super this turn. I uh, can't get one with Super Saiyan 4 Goku, but I think we'll be alright. Um, he's got over 100k defense with type advantage, and if he gets supers, he's got kind of that Super Saiyan 4 built-in mechanic where he's got the chance to dodge and counter. So we're going to kind of rely on that, cross our fingers, and I hope it all goes well, goes to plan. Um, Omar, Zelda, how lucky. I don't even have them. 
Um, yeah, it sounds like pretty good pulls to be fair. Like I, I had to, I have never actually pulled that Goku and Vegeta, the um, the physical LR one. I had to buy them with coins. So <laughs> I, I've got mine at fifty five percent, which I, it, it's not the same when you have to go and buy them. Like you, you feel proud when you summon the ball. Um, but yeah, fair play that you managed to get them. Um, Zelda, yes, Paragon, nice summon, man. Yeah, really good summons. Like it seems like everyone, like I think one of our followers, Dog Help Desk, struggled a bit like me. But other than that, most of the community that I've come across um, have absolutely smashed the Gogeta summons. Most, if not all, have come away with either Gogeta or someone else that they really wanted or needed. Um, so yeah, really happy. I'm looking at this as well. I'm really happy that. The yes, we get the counter mechanic. I never see this, and it's a crit. We'll take that. I never see that animation. I was going to say, um, we're really lucky that Goku's getting supered because he did an additional super as well when he wasn't going to get that defense boost anyway. So yeah, that's just all worked out really well. We haven't even had to use an item yet. We do a quick defense check. Um, Gohan's fine. We're happy with Goku. We'll just use his active skill as well. Um, again, I love this active skill. It's just, it's just the art. Just unreal. Love it. Um, Omar, I have the Phi Goten and Trunks, but LR Super Saiyan Blue Kai Ken Goku and the Super Saiyan Blue Evolution Vegeta, no. Yeah, I don't have Goten and Trunks either. Um, for the guys that have them in chat, I was tempted to go and buy them with coins. Um, would you guys say that they are worth it with coins? I'll I'll trust your guys' opinion, um, but yeah, I was a bit on, a fe on the fence as to whether to buy them or not. Um, I exchanged for AGL Universe 7 Boo, so it was my last rotation that I pulled them to. You say you exchanged for um, AGL Universe 7 Boo. Is that the um, gift cards that you used to go get? Um, Source the Prime. I have SSR Goku Angel and SSR Vegeta Angel. Yep, I haven't used SSR Super Gogeta yet. Um, yeah, I mean, I definitely go in and use them. Um, that's the whole point of having one of some of the new units. I, I really want the Gogeta just so I can kind of do a stream based on comparing the um, Gogeta and Vegito to each other. That was what I really wanted to do. I, 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 like me and Paragon have talked on Discord, and we're like, who do we think's better? Um, thankfully, he's managed to get both, and I'm sure he's going to do his own showcase at some point. So if you do see again, if you see Paragon streaming, or if you want to go give him a follow, go check him out. Um, go check out his summon video as well. His summon video is pretty cool. Um, I'm not going to give it all away. Um, but also, he, he did a Corroded Body and Mind run. And I know a lot of people have struggled with Corroded Body and Mind. I know I did. Thankfully, I managed to get it done as well. But um, Paragon's also going to be doing his own Corroded Body and Mind run for, for his little community as well. So, yeah, if you guys have struggled with the with those missions, go definitely go give him a follow. Go check him out. Um... Source the Prime, you're slacking, you need to use Gogeta. Yeah, definitely, man. You, it, that's the whole point of having one of the new shiny units, isn't it? It's to go kind of show them off. Um, Kevin Cleaver will take care of themselves here. Gohan should be 174k, we're fine even if we get supered. Um, what's LR Gohan looking like? 127k. To get, I think even if we get supered, we're in pretty good standing, so I'm going to take that. Um, and yes, it was the gift card. I mean, I don't even think my my um, Dragon Ball Super Boo is rainbow. So I've got two gift cards. And I was saying at the beginning of the stream as well. I've got, I don't know who to use for the gift cards because I've got all of them. Some of them are rainbow. But yeah, I just don't know who to get. I don't want to just buy someone. Like I could go get like, I don't know, Tech Buller or something like that and just use it as SA fodder. But yeah, I'm really torn. I'll just end up being so torn that I don't know who to get and I just end up won't using them. And I do it, and it's just so annoying. But, uh, yeah, just too much choice, too much choice. Um, Paragon, which Gogeta you mean, uh, Source the Prime? Uh, he means the, um, the the new one, the Tech Angel Goku and Vegeta that just dropped, that uh, fused to Gogeta. He hasn't actually had a chance to use them. So, yeah, definitely go and jump on. At Barwood Town, you're being too kind, bro. Nah, credit where credit's due, man. I, I check out your content. Um, there's a couple of people in stream, a couple of the followers that I, um, that I check out their content as well. I, I've watched a couple of Zelda's um, videos as well. So, yeah, def definitely go check out each other's videos, guys. Lo loads of good content. Like, I've taken all sorts of ideas from different people that I've watched. 
um, and even some of the ways I approach my streams, I, I've, I've kind of watched how Paragon talks to his um, viewers as well, and I've tried to take a few tips from there as well. So, yeah, it's a bit of something for everyone. Uh, let's pop Super Saiyan 4 Goku's active skill. I'm conscious as well that we haven't used an item yet. This might be the turn that we have to. Um, I'll go and have a look at everyone's defences before I have to do anything. Um, Zelda, I could definitely use a duplicate of AGL transforming Dragon Ball Super Gogeta. Oh, don't even talk to me about that unit. <laughs> I've got him rainbowed and I've got three dupes in his SSR as well. Um, yeah, I pulled two of him in my summons. I literally got him in the, him in the same summons. So I've got, what, a Vegito, like a transforming Vegito animation. Vegito, Super Vegito. I was like, oh my god, guys. Oh my god, this is the, this is the Gogeta. Like, oh my god, I'm going to lose my shit. And then I got the AGL Gogeta. And literally, you just hear, like, the air leave my lungs. And I just get so deflated. I was like, no, 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 guys. I'm going to pick myself back up. Summon isn't over. We're going to go. We're going to keep going. Because it was only on, like, unit number four at that point. And literally two clicks later, I got another AGL Gojis. <laughs> and I was like, oh my day. Like, what is my life? Um, but yeah, if you need dupe for him, fair play. I'm, I'm sure you'll get him. He, he, he tends to be on a fair few banners. Um, yeah, he, he's a bit older now, so I'm sure you can... I wouldn't advise buying him with red coins, but hopefully you can pick him up anyway. Um, Source the Prime, I want to get Super Gogeta to, to UR before I start using him and shit. Yeah, I definitely get him fully awakened. Uh, it, I know it's a bit of a grind to get all the medals done. Um, I was so keen on getting this Gogeta, I went and um, farmed all the medals that I'd need before I actually did any summons for him. And then I didn't get him, so I've just got all the medals sat there. So hopefully, hopefully on this stream, we can pick Gogeta up and um, it will justify me getting all these medals. Um, let's have a quick defense check. So... UI Goku will take care of himself. Bear in mind, we're over halfway at this point. Um, yeah, I'll use the Princess Snake just to give us that heal, just to make sure we are okay. Um, uh, can I... I'm going to do here. Uh, if we pick up these, then I can super attack with Super Saiyan 4 Goku as well. And that seems to work out all right. Um, I'll be buzzing if we can see one of the revival animations, because I just never get to see those. I'm conscious we've got two UI Goku... Oh, no, just the one UI Goku on rotation in the team so um yeah it'd be cool if we can see the revival mechanic if not in this fight at some point in the video um let me have a quick look through wow there's been a couple of messages let me just catch up again i i'm horrendous at managing both <laughs> um zelda because he's decent but like his defense falls apart in the mui goku phase and the fighting legend goku yeah, a lot of those the older units do kind of struggle at that point, and you can't really dodge either. Um, is there a reason why you're doing the Fighting Legend Goku event? Is there a mission you're trying to get done that maybe we can kind of help team build for you at all? Um, Source the Prime, ah, fair enough, man. You'll you'll love them, I'm sure. Yeah, man, when you get them all fully like ranked up, leveled up, and ready to go, I'm sure that you'll love them. Um, Everyone seems to like. Everyone's like, all oh, one of the best units in the game. So definitely a good thing that you've pulled him. Hopefully you can get them all sorted and and awakened sooner rather than later, so that you can make the most out of them. This is going to be a nice bit of healing here with Ken and Gleef. Yeah, we take that. Um, and again, we're not too fussed about Khalifa in that last spot. She's just going to dodge. So yeah, like again, this really isn't too hard of a run now, guys. Um, yeah, smashing it. Um, source the prime. No, I just remember I use SSR Goku Angel and Vegeta Angel. I got them to UR and they are great. Uh, yeah, really. I, I never. That's one thing though. I other when I like I pull an LR, I awaken them all to it, up to LR. But I never try out like the SSR or the UR. Probably should just to see the artwork that you can get with them. So might be worth doing. Um, I just realised that the gameplay went a little bit laggy there. Uh, <laughs> you can tell because that's when um, I accidentally tabbed off of the mirror streaming app. <laughs> so that's when the gameplay went a little bit weird. Uh, bear with it, it will catch up. I do apologise, guys. Um, Aragon, I could, give me the copies, man. I could use them. If I could send you extra dupes, I have, uh, I, have I would. Uh, yeah, we regularly have this conversation about how good it would be if we could um, transfer dupes and things that we don't need. 
That'd be that would be the life. Um, everyone, give me your Gogetas. Twenty four K Zelda. I've been getting way more Gregory medals ever since reaching experience rank two seven five. I'm now rank three hundred one. It's always Gregory that I run out of. I literally have to go and like buy more from the Baba shop. Otherwise, I just constantly run out. So yeah, definitely good that you're getting those medals, man. Hang on to them. Let's quick, do a quick defense check. So yeah, we're gonna put this friend one with three hundred K defense, two hundred sixty K defense there. Um, UI Goku. He'll just do UI Goku things, and we'll pick up a super attack with this Gohan as well. Uh, I don't think we're going to kill him this turn, but I would have thought next turn, especially with Kale and Khalifa doing like three super attacks. Um, yeah, Ivan should be down and out of it. Fingers crossed. Um, Source the Prime, SSR Goku Angel and SSR Vegeta Angel. Passive ability is solid because it changes normal key spheres to rainbow key spheres and shit. Yeah, so the LR does that as well. Um, yeah, just any sort of rainbow orb changer, they're always really useful units. So definitely, man, I'm, I'm excited for you to go away and get this farmed and get it all grinded up. Um, let us know again in the chat and stuff um, in future streams once you've got it done and what you kind of think of them. Uh, I wish I had the opportunity. It's something I really want to do on stream and do a comparison video. But, uh, but yeah, I can't really do that until I pull the unit, which is always the problem with those kind of videos. Um, this should be the last turn, I'm thinking. Uh, again, we, we've even got an item still in hand, so we, we haven't really struggled too much. Um, it's just one of those things like type advantage against Ivan. He's not going to be doing too much damage to us, especially with the amount of defensive stackers. We have kind of walked through a little bit. Um, Zelda, I'd almost forgotten, but you get 20 Dragon Stones every 20 ranks until just yesterday when I reached rank 300. Yeah, like, I do miss the early stone rewards, <laughs> especially with all like, the kind of um, things they're doing with, like, quadruple rank XP at the moment for, for certain, um, for, well, for all the quest stages, but they do that for certain doping festivals, don't they? Um, yeah, it really helps you grind rank. I think I'm 500 and something. I've got a, a fair few stones when I hit rank 500, but other than that, it's kind of slim pickings. I think you're only, re like, the major milestones are, like, the, the triple digits are, like, Five 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 or six six six. You tend to get a couple. Um, Zelda. I have like ten missions left on that event and the GT Goku one. I just needed to wait till Pycon's event comes out of the Portal of Memories to awaken it. Um, so, so I think that comes out on Mondays. I think anyway. Um, that could have been keys that you got from the uh, Paronga um, rewards. That would have helped you get the Pycon done. But yeah, Pycon will be really good for, for any team that he's on, just for his uh, support type ability, and also the fact that if you get him a rainbow keys for he can dodge. So definitely a good idea to, to get that pike on sorted. Um, I'm genuinely really surprised this event is still going. Look how much health Ivan has. I can't even see in that top grey bar um, how much health he's got. Like, it must be an absolute slither. Um, yeah, we'll take it though. He is dead this turn, 100% guaranteed, unless he dodges like everyone's attacks. I even think like a Khalifa normal will kill him. Um, which missions do you need to get done then on the, on that OG Goku event? Obviously it's, his event's been out for quite a while, so I'd have thought most of the teams on there would be reasonably easy to get him done. They would have all had a, a fair few buffs. So again, if there's any particular team that you, you, you want help building with, or if you need a certain friend unit, by all means join our Discord. Um, if anything, I'll go get the Discord link up now, so we've got a fair few people here. But um, if people do need help with team builds and that kind of thing, or they want to kind of add friends so that we can put up friend units, that's probably one of the things that I've found has benefited me most since starting doing this streaming, is that through streaming I've met so many amazing people. And literally, I can put a message in the Discord going, Hey guys, I'm going to do a Corroded Body and Mines run. Does anyone mind putting up a, a Janemba lead for me? And I'll have like six Janemba leads. So yeah, really happy with our Discord community. If anyone does need help with it, um, yeah, feel free to join up. There's the Discord link in the chat. Um, Zelda, people have questioned me when unlocking the top left node in the hidden potential uh, for characters and then I had to explain that like I just didn't have the super attacks and I needed to unleash some more potential and the top left was the only way to go. 
Yeah, so especially if you haven't done um, super attacks, like, you need to get them, what, to SA... Well, you need to get them to SA-10 to be able to do the bottom right. Sometimes just doing the, the top left is the way to go because it lets you get... Um, because it does let you get the extra additionals and stuff like that. Um, Paragon, I absolutely agree. If it's a defensive slash support unit and I don't plan to fill their SA super quick, top left is best call for sure. Yeah, it's just easy getting additionals, um, crits uh, and dodges without having to invest too much. Obviously, you have to invest invest orbs, um, but you don't have to get, get them all the way up to 10 SA, which can be a bit of a pain in the ass. Um, if we go into Moscow then, so if anyone in chat has done Moscow, correct me if I'm wrong, but I think Moscow is the AoE unit. Um, am I right in thinking that? Um, he can super attack everyone. So this is the team that I used last time. Um, kind of an interesting team <laughs> looking at it. Uh, no B Pan, I see. Why would I have bought this team? I mean, this team must have done it. So was it a final trump card slash fusions? Um, so I'm guessing these are all on what the final trump card team. Yeah, it's a really wonky team. It must have worked. Um, yeah, he's on final trump card as well. <laughs> um, I can be any of the gods of destruction with the characters I have. You can't be any of the gods of destruction with the characters I have. Um, Nothing to be ashamed of there, man. The, the God of Destruction event is, like, really tough. Um, like, of the team that I'm showing here on screen, so this is what this is the team that I've used to beat Moscow previously. Do you have all of those units? I, I'd expect you to have, like, at least kind of the LR Blue Vegito, because he's kind of a free-to-play unit that you can pick up just by finishing the quests and grinding quests now. Um, I, I definitely encourage everyone that hasn't already to go and do the quests because then you um, it, it's stones isn't it, it's easy stones especially with so many good celebrations coming up and so many good bits of content that you'll need stones for if you haven't done the quest stages definitely go get the quest stages sorted um, yeah if anything I, let's just go and have a look as well uh, so we want STR um, what was it, Fusion or Final Trump card where is it? And just go see if we can get an updated partial match and see what other units might be available to us. Yeah, I mean, looking at it, this is probably why I've gone for the team that I have. Um, there probably weren't too many other options. Um, but I do like having the Gogetas, though, because you put them in slot three. Not only do they have type advantage, but they have the chance to dodge supers and that kind of thing. So we'll, we'll jump in again with this team. Um, we'll see how we go. I'm not going to hold my breath too much, though. Um, Zelda, I have all of those except for the transforming Super Saiyan Goku. Um, yeah, I mean, as we've just seen from what I've just shown on screen, like my box at least, um, I don't really have any other STR units that would fall under Gogeta's act, uh, leader skill. Um, let me do this run. We'll certainly go back and have a look. Because if you've got all of those units minus the, the Super Saiyan Goku, at least it's the basis of a team. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll try and have a look for you. Um, so we want Gogeta in that slot 3 because he gets that chance to dodge. We want a super attack with Topo. So if I remember rightly, when Topo supers, he buffs the rest of the team. Yeah, raises allies attack by 30%. So we want that Topo. Supering. Um, this blue Vegito, again, really good unit. Um, I, I'd be excited for him to get an easy egg. Uh, but we want him doing 12 keys just so he's stacking. What's he up to defense-wise? 122k turn one. I do really appreciate that Vegito. He was like one of my first LRs as well. Um, really good free-to-play unit even now. A Paragon at Zelda. Like Bard said, there's nothing to worry about. Your box will improve in time. If you join the Discord, feel free to send a pic of your box in the chat and we'll see if we can help with any of the gods. Yeah, definitely. Like, that's, that's what, what I like, uh, again, about the Discord, it's just like a real community feeling. So, um, if you are struggling with content or anything like that, either I'm about, Paragon's about, we've got another follower called Dog who uh, who's quite keen, he's quite fun to wind up, but he'll always give you feedback and help out with teams. He actually gets quite annoyed if he offers help and you don't take it, because he 
I'm saying this from experience, it tends to be right with the advice he gives. Um, you need to awaken Topo. Topo is sick for this. Yes, if you haven't got Topo awakened, go do it. So I'll go I'll, I'll go on to his passive in a second when I can have a look at the units. But um, not only is he like 40% support to the rest of the rotation, um, he gets damage reduction and all that kind of stuff as well. Wow, we got slapped a bit there, didn't we? <laughs> um, where's Topo? So yeah, super attack causes supreme damage to enemy uh, and raises allies attack by 30% for a turn. Pretty good. Um, passive, attack and defense plus 70%. All allies, key plus one and attack and defense plus 40%. So pretty good. And all enemies, defense minus 70%. So again, pretty good. Uh, and reduces damage received by 40% when HP is 70% or less. So, if he was on rotation here, as well as having like 100k plus defense, you'd be having damage reduction as well. Um, I don't know, I'm not 100% sure what to do here. I'll probably... If I put Kalifla there, we'll get a super attack with Goku and Vegeta. Then we'll float Super Saiyan Goku off. Uh, what's his defense? 87k. Who have we got up next? I'll probably save those STR orbs for a bit of healing next turn. Yeah, we'll get the super attack with um, using those AGL orbs. That'll work pretty well for us, to be honest. Um, Zelda, not only for that, but also for the Infinite Dragon Ball history, which I only have like four more challenges to do on. But incidentally, that was another piece of content that I was thinking of giving a bit more love on stream um so i've done a, lot, a fair few super battle road streams and videos oh we got supered ah uh, that's not too bad um yeah we've, done, we've given super battle road some love we've given extreme super battle road some love i did the new infinite dragon ball history um stage live on stream but yeah i haven't really gone through any of the other ones on stream so that's certainly on my to-do list uh what missions is it yours or what challenges slash missions is it that you're still that you still have outstanding uh, again we're gonna put topo in that first slot and where we're under um 70 percent health he's gonna have 40 percent damage reduction so he should take care of himself um where we're getting that super attack with him as well he's gonna give everyone a bit more attack um we can't help but get an 18 key here with vegeto which i ideally wouldn't have wanted to do but at least he's going to give us a fair bit of healing. I want to hold off on using another Princess Snake if I can. And we'll get a super attack with Gogeta. So we're on turn 3 at the moment. So turn 4, next turn then. We are going to transform with our next Gogeta on rotation. So from there he'll start building up. Getting pretty good. He'll keep his chance to dodge in slot 3. But he'll also begin stacking a uh, building up attack and defense from his passive. So uh, yeah, really excited to get him on rotation. And a double super from Topo. So our... Allies are getting, what, an extra 60% attack from um, Topo Super Attack Effect? 3 million attacks that hit from a free-to-play LR that came out like four years ago. Ah, oh, I, I just love this Vegito. Old, yeah, but still so relevant. Um, Zelda, I have a super nice spread on my Goku and Vegeta. Uh, I'm assuming that's the STR one. I have like 14 combo and 12 crit. Yeah, there really isn't a wrong way to go with the STR, that STR unit. You want the additionals for when they for when they're not transformed. You want the crit for when they uh, for when they do transform. You kind of damned if you do, damned if you don't. Um, but yeah, as you've done, it's really important to get a good spread across these units because they're just going to be so useful. Um, we're going to put Khalifa there so she can dodge all of that. In fact, let's transform with uh, with Vegito. We'll, we'll, first we want the 50% heal but um, also we want the foresight so for example if I can see that we're not getting souped in that first slot I might put Vegito in slot 1 and just let him go ham with his counters and just let him blitz it um, Paragon, oh man you got two dupes in the new tech Gogeta nice luck oh, have I missed something there then I have a nice spread in my Goku and Vegeta. I just assumed you meant the STR one, or were you actually talking about the Tech Gogeta one? My bad. Um, so we can see that uh, Moscow isn't supering, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to put Vegito there. Um, he can go get his 18 key and go do bits. We'll give 
Kelly from that one orb, and then this Gogeta can go a little bit crazy in the end slot as well. Um, yeah, we'll take that. Um, Zelda, crits are nice. Um, <laughs> crits are nice, but I've seen some really stupid spreads on some characters. I've seen put a level put level 24 crit on AGL Super Saiyan Gogeta when he guaranteed crits anyway. <laughs> like, why the hell would they do that? Yeah, like, that's... Yeah, that boggles the mind. It might just be people that don't really understand the game mechanics or that don't play too much of the game. But yeah, that's a bit weird, isn't it? Um, he's already guaranteed to crit after transforming. I'd be focusing on combos to stack up as many crits as possible. Yeah, I'd be exactly the same. He doesn't need dodge either, does he? He has, what, a high chance to dodge after he's transformed? So you don't really need to build on that. You just literally want to stack him as much as possible with um, with additionals. Uh, Paragon, I may be completely wrong at Barwood Town. Don't quote me. Uh, I don't have the new Tech Gogeta. So I was right. It was the STR Vegeta. <laughs> I wasn't sure, and then I felt really stupid, <laughs> but I did understand correctly. <laughs> uh, Paragon, oh damn, sorry, my bad. Um, nah, it's fine, mate. I, I, I misunderstand things so much. I, again, I struggle kind of focusing on the game and then focusing on the chat, and I ended up doing, I ended up doing half hours version of doing both. So it's absolutely fine. Genuinely, don't worry. Um, getting a transformation with Super Saiyan Goku. I do still love this animation. The unit himself isn't great anymore, but um, but yeah, I do still like seeing that animation. Um, I'm talking about STR Patara, Goku and Vegeta, yes. Perfect. That is the one that I thought we, we were talking about as well. Um, I'm looking here, Topo, he's a little bit over 70%, so he's not going to get his damage reduction. Um, but I suppose he's going to get super attack either way. Um, I can't get a super attack with him, I don't think. So if I do this, I can, I can get my 12 key with Vegito. I can go here and get super attack with Topo. Do you reckon we're going to die here, guys? So group super, so super attack launch. Everyone's getting supered. We've got 145k defense, 100k defense, and 100k defense. I think we should be all right on this stage because Moscow attacks all. His super attacks do a little less. Um, as I like to say on the stream, we are going to risk it for the biscuit. Um, I could be terribly wrong, though. Uh, oh, yeah, we're dead. No, no. I'm not sure. No, we're not dead. We're alive! <laughs> um, it's all good. I wish I had Gogeta. I'd be done with my damn fusion challenges by now if that was the case. Yeah, a lot of people seem like they need Gogeta. Like, I don't need Gogeta, but I just want him, you know? Um, I've got all the all the challenges for all the difficult content done, but it's not the same. Like, you want the you want the new units, and um, I guarantee that they're going to bring, like, time limit st stages out. So isn't there a time limit stage for um, the legendary Vegeta event that JP have? Um, I'm sure Omar could tell us tell us if he was still in uh, still in the chat but i think he's left now um but i'm pretty sure there is time li time limit missions that require that gogeta coming out so yeah i, I definitely do want him if i can get him. we're getting super again um, no it's fine we'll use our princess snake at this point um so who's where so you raise attack and defense for one turn so if i put you there when you super, you're gonna do a little. You're gonna take a little bit less damage from that normal, and you'll link up better with um, Super Saiyan Blue Gogeta as well. Let's have a quick defense check of Gogeta. 76k, not not great. No. Um, do they give themselves key on attack? I think they do. Key plus five launches an additional attack. Um, so he doesn't give himself key in slot three. But he does launch an additional super and high chance of evading. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll give him that, those, those SDR orbs then. We'll make sure he's going to double super. And he should be doing a fair bit of damage. Not too worried about this super though. Khalifa's going to dodge. Vegito takes a bit. And Gogeta got tagged as well. Yeah, it's a lot of damage, man. Um... I'm actually hoping that LR Fi Goku and Vegeta Fusion will be on the Janemba banner. Um, they're not. So, 
the Janemba banner is a top banner, if I'm thinking of the right unit. Do you mean like the Dogen Fest three-year Goku and Vegeta? Um, because they, they won't be, because they're Dogen Fest. So essentially, think of it as like the colour coin. So the uh, Goku and Vegeta are a red coin unit, and the Janemba and his banner are all yellow coins, so you won't find red coin units on the yellow banner, if that makes sense. Um, at least like, if that's the unit I think that you mean. Um, I know what you mean. For all the hard hitters that Fusion has, they can still take a pounding. Yeah, it's, that's where Fusion really lacked, isn't it? They haven't really got a very good defensive, um, a really good defensive unit, like a defensive tank, which is probably what they need. And one reason why I want the Tech Goku and Vegeta, probably because they are one of the better defensive units on the team. Um, oh, this is going to be a treat. So we know that there's no super attack coming our way. Let's go and use this active skill. I haven't seen this in ages. Again, one of my favorite arts for, for any kind of animation on this game. Um, I love this uh, action skill. Um, the LR, Fi Goku and Vegeta Fusion are a confessed LR. Won't be on the Chinemba banner, sadly. Yeah, as I said, um, unfortunately, red coin units, you just can't get them on a yellow coin banner, which is which is really annoying. Um, not as annoying as not being able to get a super attack with Topo, though. Um, not the end of the world, so he's got, what, two bars of health left? I'm not going to be too fussed about getting a stack with um, blue Vegito. I'd rather just get damage at this point now. Um, I'm not sure how confident I am, so we shouldn't take too much damage this turn. Next turn, it's all about where the super is. If he supers slot one, I might struggle. If he supers slot two or three... And I can get a couple of crit counters in with STR Vegito. I, I might be all right. So let's see what's going to happen. Um, Gogeta will be fine. I have no duplicates on him. I know he can survive that. Um, he can do bits. I see. Well, that's unfortunate. So Janemba is going to be a legendary summon. Yeah, so um, Janemba is a legendary summon banner. So it, te it tends to be all the part two banners are like the legendary summon banners. Um... So, yeah, it'd be a yellow coin mana. Uh, so, no Goku and Vegeta on that one, unfortunately. Um, but the thing is, with Goku and Vegeta, they're pretty much always going to be... Oh, they are. They're, they're always going to be a featured unit. So, if you go on a banner and you hit that scouter, if they're not on that scouter, they're not going to be on the banner, unfortunately. Um, how are we looking here? Oh, we can get Goku's Rage Mode. This could probably get us over the line here, guys. This should be Moscow Down first attempt as well. Absolutely smashing it. Can we get some supers with him? That is the question. We can. Yeah, this... This this should be the dub, guys. We'll take that. Oh, I never get to see this rage mode, either. Um, a Zelda. A uh, Paragon at Zelda. Absolutely right. So at least there is potential for another unfeatured LR to be pulled. Yeah, so that's always the thing with um, the Legendary Summon banners. You, you've got the featured LR, but then all the other yellow coin LRs, they're all there as unfeatured. So, for example, when you get like the, the Super Vegito fusing summon animation, that, could, that, that means you're guaranteed an LR, I think. I'm pretty sure I'm right in saying that. From what I remember, like one of Truth streams. Um, I don't think it means a featured. I think it literally means like getting an LR. And that is Moscow dead. We'll take that. <laughs> but yeah, you can. there's a chance of getting literally any yellow coin LR. And it gets kind of more diluted because there's like 50 or 60 odd of the yellow coin LRs now. So if there's a particular one you want, um, it, it gets quite hard to get them. Um, it's a good thing about kind of the um, the easy A's for those LRs though, because then they get their own like little banner where it's a bit easier to pull them. Not that that helped me with um, LR Super Saiyan 2, Gohan, and LR Bardock, who I still don't have copies of. Um, Zelda, by the way, I got a duplicate of Tech Transforming Janemba when I was summoning on the Gogeta banners. Really good pull there, man. Um, I only managed to pull my first on the Gogeta banners, and it was so important for me to get that done. Um, because I needed him for the Corroded Body and Mind GT Goku event. Um, so now that you've got a him, hopefully yours is going to be a little bit better as well. Um, and it should do some bits for you. It should really help you um, with 
pretty much any any difficult content that you can put that number on just with his guard and his kind of support type abilities raises defense and super as well um yeah really good pull there man definitely get some additional in him um paragon nice i didn't have any before the banner and thankfully was able to summon two will be having my second time trying to beat the gt goku event with a corroded body in mind a bit later yes and i will be tuning into that because i i know how hard that event is so any support that i can give um i'm definitely gonna be there to see it um, and then we'll go up against Catella. Catella is the next um, God of Destruction. What I'll do, we'll do this Catella. We'll run through with that. And then I'll, I reckon I'll do my summon then as well. How's that sound, guys? Um, so what team did we use last time? So it looks like I just tried to bring the Gogeta. I just went for Super in. Um, we can definitely... Be better that now. I say definitely, probably. Um, let's go have a look at Super Saiyans and what's your leader skill? It's Legendary Existence, isn't it? Yeah. Ah, oh, this should be pretty easy. I'm pretty sure the UI Goku's are on here on Legendary Existence. So, Super Saiyan, so I want you as my lead, I want you, 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 um, I'll bring you in case I start to get smacked around a little bit, we'll bring Khalifla because we just know how much we love her dodging, and then, it's not just me, like, that seems like a pretty sick team, <laughs> we, sh we should walk through this event. I, I think, anyway, I don't want to get too cocky, but that team seems a lot better than the team I brought last night. We'll, we'll see how we do, though. We'll see how we do. Um, if I get something off the gym of Banner, it'll be my first successful summon on a legendary Banner. It does happen. It's hard, though. though. It, it's the odds are stacked against you. I, if you've got stones, I'd maybe only do one or two summons and then save the rest of your stones. I try not to go too deep on a legendary summon banner. As much as I want the physical Janemba, um, I'm not going to be going like all out to get him. Um, do you get dragon stones from the God of Destruction event? I think you get five. I think it's yeah, Paragon five or seven per stage you beat. Yeah, you get stones for beating this, so you get one just for beating like the event, like as you do normally. And then there's missions as well. Um, I should be able to check that as well. We, we'll go and have a look. Um, that's going to be a nice turn for Goku for slot 1 um, so we don't have to worry too much about Khalifa in that last slot um, it's all about how much damage is the Gohan is the Goku going to take in that first slot 50k still from normals um, at least he's going to get some uh, he's going to double soup here so that, that will drop immensely um Plus, you unlock the Zeno support memory, which is super useful for reps team. Yeah, so not just reps team, to any universe survival saga content you do. So even if you want to do like the um, universe survival saga super battle road or something like that. Um, yeah, the, the Zeno animation is really good. I don't know if you got like the um, the Freezer and Goku support memory that came out on the download celebration, um, where they like. The, I think the freezer animation gives 15% attack and defense just for the whole fight to extreme Namek Saga units go for the Super Namek Saga. Um, the Zeno is like that, but just for Universe Survival Saga, and I think it's like 10%. So it doesn't sound like a massive percentage, but that Zeno is really good for, for those teams. Um, Zelda, if I get LR Janemba, I'll be able to do a movie bosses challenges without a doubt. I think that's what a lot of people want this Janemba for. So, I haven't got the intro either. And I'm very conscious that we're getting... Well, the next bout of Extreme Super Battle Roads that are supposed to drop has Extreme Battle Road stage for movie bosses. So, I'm going to get absolutely splattered because movie boss leads, I've got AGL Turlers, who's just old now, and who else have I got for movie bosses? I can't be the only movie boss's lead. I'm probably, I'm probably forgetting someone. Paragon will probably remind me. But, um, but yeah. 
movie bosses definitely needs leaders, so nice. Nice if uh, if uh, you get him and it will help you do that. Um, I'm conscious that we're going to get slapped here by with, with the Goku again. Um, I don't want to use an item this early, but I... He supers with that, so I'm going to use the snake. And we'll jump in with the Gotenks as well. So Gotenks will raise his defense. So I'm not too worried here. Hopefully Goku gets supered and it will vindicate my decision to use the item. Um, Paragon, lol, that's what Khalifa is there for. Yeah, literally for the dodge. 100% <laughs> dodge chance, yes please. Zelda, I'll bet LR Gemma dodges like a motherfucker. Um, just be like, try and hit me, bitch. Um, I have seen Janemba is basically one of, if not the best defensive unit in the game. Because he guards as well, doesn't he? And then he nullifies um, he nullifies beam super attacks. Or I think it's like a high chance to nullify beam super attacks. So, yeah. I, I definitely really want this Janemba. I think a lot of the community are. I haven't been this hyped about an LR um, a legendary summon banner unit since, like, Kale and Khalifa came out. Like, I... I that was the last legendary summon banner unit. Like I actually chased them until I got them. Um, I'm not going to do that on this banner. Uh, I want to with Janemba. I really want to, but I just can't justify it. Like it's just so unlikely. I'll I'll do one or two on him, and yeah, just fingers crossed. Really, uh, fingers crossed for everyone. Hopefully, there's someone in the Discord or someone in the community that goes and pulls him. Because fair play to you guys if you do. Um. Pretty good position. We know Goku's going to double super here because if he gets supered before he super attacks, um, it means he gets the additional super. Uh, we can't get super attacks with anyone else on rotation though, which is annoying. Not the end of the world though. At least Patella is super attacking this Goku. 200k damage still. It's a lot. Um, after this turn though, the, this Super Saiyan Goku at least will be taking double digits. So we'll take that. Um... Zelda, I don't even have a leader, so if I just use Janemba for the extreme class lead, yeah, like Janemba's leader skill is really good, so he doesn't have an extreme class lead, does he? He's movie bosses and corroded body and mind lead, so yeah, he he's definitely got <laughs> definitely putting money into it. Yeah, the Janemba's really good, so definitely looking forward to it. Um, I, I don't encourage putting money into it, but um, I, I can understand why you would. And we've got Brains in the chat. Hello, Barwood. Hello, Brains. Um, good to catch you here, man. How are you? You having a good day? Um, Paragon, if you do, best of luck. Um, and then at Brains, hey, buddy. Yes, if you do summon Zelda, if, you, if you've joined the Discord, let us know your pulls. Even if you just jump into a stream and let us know your pulls. Let us know how you do, man. We're, we're definitely excited to see how people do. I, I just love seeing people pull the new, new unit. So, yeah, make that a thing. Um, we can get a summon here with uh, a super attack here with Goku. If we get the rainbow orb there with Gogeta, he gets a chance to dodge. And Khalifa dodges anyway. Um, I might have. Yeah, yeah, we're dead. <laughs> Not the end of the world though. Um, let's say we're dead anyway. I'll probably do my summon now, guys. Um, Brains is joined at the right time. Um, Brains, I haven't even started gods other than the first three. I'm a noob. <laughs> Yeah, you need to get on it, Brains. Um, yeah, loads of stones there for you to get, though. Stones that you can put into Janemba. Um, Paragon, all good here, keeping well. Uh, I was talking about tech Janemba, transforming Janemba for the extreme class lead. Yes, that's also a really good alternative for movie bosses. Um, I didn't even think of that. Yeah, you can use him, because he is a movie boss, isn't he? So, um, any other movie bosses that are on Corroded Body and Mind will get the full buff. But if not, you can use it as extreme class part of his leader skill. Um, softball brains, yeah, just hanging out, doing some work, but decided to help Barwood Town get to affiliate. Yes, I appreciate that, man. Um, yeah, we got another follow off this stream, so seven more. Literally counting it down. Um, seven more, and we'll be on to affiliate. So absolutely buzzing. Um, we're inching closer day by day, but yeah, appreciate you, you dropping in to support the stream. Really appreciate it. Zelda, yeah, I'll keep you updated for sure. Yeah, please do, man. Again, fingers crossed. I like doing summons on here. I like doing group summons. I just love people telling me like who they've got flying in and that kind of thing. Obviously, fingers crossed everyone pulls them. Um, ooh, sorry I was confused. 
Uh, I've probably missed something in the chat again. <laughs> uh, softball brains, I want Gogeta. We threw like 600 Go into Gogeta and no dice. Yeah, I, I put 900 into him, man. I feel real pain. No Gogeta. Um, dang it. Sorry to hear, brains. Um, yeah, like it's, it's just never good getting shafted by a unit. Um, so let's actually have a look at the mission. So to answer Zelda's question, you get five stones then for each stage that you clear. And then you get one stone just for like just the general clearer stage. So six stones in total you get for each one of these that you beat. And then you get the final like um, Kai's and Zenny and all that stuff if you defeat them all and you get the Zeno support. So well worth doing, well worth getting it done. Um, Sprains, we woke up at 4.30am EST on my stream and we did morning summons. I was broken. <laughs> yeah, like it's it's... I, I had to hold off though because he dropped like first thing I couldn't stream first thing in the morning and I didn't want to do any summons off stream because I knew it would have been just my luck that I'd have got a Zeno in like my first summon off stream and then I'd get nothing in my stream so I was like no I'm going to hold off and then I got nothing anyway <laughs> um, Barbara is a secret Dokun god I wouldn't go for god um, but yeah I like the way that feels <laughs> Nah, I, I've just been playing it for for a while. I've got most. I've got now that I've got corroded body and mind mission done for the Goku event. I've, I've literally got all the hard content missions done again now, which that that was really annoying me for ages. Um, so now ready and waiting for the new um, for the new Super Battle Road. Big spender? No, no, not at all. Um, I pick up the sales. So like if I go into the shop here, um, I think I've only picked up one batch of sales stones. I think I picked up the one thirty two, one of the thirty two packs. Um, I'll probably pick up kind of the cheaper ones, um, but yeah, um, I, I, I don't, I don't really spend. I pick up sales. I, I don't buy the non-sale stones, um, but yeah, I, I ended up having so many stones for this Gogeta celebration just because of that Bulma event from the download celebration. I just saved those stones. I just had loads. Um, let's get this Tech Gogeta. Get in Barwood's box. Uh, so it means you still got sales. Wow, I picked up everything on the stream the other day. Man, stones in the UK are cheap. Um, they were a little bit more expensive as well. So if I go back here, they all dropped by like a pound, a pound fifty for some of them um, a couple months ago. So yeah, we, we take that. Um, Paragon, yeah, I still have to buy mine. I, I've been trying to hold off because in the Play Store, sometimes you get it that Dokun is like one of the games where for every like pound you spend, you get more extra points. So that's what I've been holding off on doing. Um, if it doesn't happen, I'll probably pick them up in the next couple of days, and hopefully I'll be kind of like 350 stones again. Um, but yeah, still trying to pick back up from where I got shafted by Gogeta. Um, in Canada, the 91 pack is $58. So, the 91 pack. So it's $28.99. I don't know, honestly, I don't know what the conversion rate is. So you see $28.99, but that's sterling. I don't know how that converts to dollars. Um, yeah, that exchange rate. Um, these are not cheap, no. Anyway, enough of beating around the bush. I've had enough foreplay. I've been itching to do this summon all day. As you can see, guys, 10 tickets there. I'm going to turn up the, the volume so I can hear the animations. Um, to confirm where I've got these tickets from, guys, if you are watching, I got five from the countdown. So from just, I think it was just from logging in and getting the daily missions done on the build up to this campaign. I got one today from just the daily missions, so for logging in for a, the seventh day of, as part of this celebration, I got one ticket, so that takes me up to six. And then if you go back into the Bubba Shop, um, again I'll show you, um, if you go into the Bubba Shop, you can go to Special, and if you have a look here, it will have some things where you can buy. So I bought the Exploding Gratitude Pack for £3.49. And it, as you can see there on the left, it gives you four tickets. So that gets me up to my total of ten. Living in Canada is a shaft. I wouldn't say that. I'd love to go to Canada. But anyway, let's go. Again, last Gogeta summon I'm going to be doing. Fingers crossed. Right. We're going to see a Black Rift, aren't we? Black Rift. That's what we want to see. In we go. Please. No Black Rift. Gohan, Trunks and Shoutsu. Damn. Kamehameha. So we need like a mad like fake out or something like that. 
no screen break. And of course it starts with AGL Janemba. Oh, damn. I'm not holding my breath here, guys. I'd love to get a fake out or something. I'd love to be proven wrong. Wrong freezer third form. I would like the other banner unit. <laughs> and the guaranteed one is Kuliza! <laughs> I've never pulled that unit before. Oh my god. What an amazing pull. That's thumbnail worthy. Uh, everything begins and ends with SR AGL Janemba. Yeah, I agree with that, man. I pulled like third. I think like I went to go put like um, Super SA into my Tech Janemba, and I pulled. I went to like go see what units I could feed in, and I had thirteen of the AGL Janemba from my summons that I could feed in. I mean, I got him up, I got the Janemba up to ten SA for free essentially, but. Yeah, it was just annoying. Um, dead summon. I, I honestly, I was expecting it after how my summon luck went on the previous stream, but it's not the end of the world, guys. Like, we can't all get every unit, and hopefully, this just, this just means that I'm gonna pull uh, pull Janemba in my first summon, which would be ideal. <laughs> anyway, guys, I'm probably gonna end the stream there. Um, cheeky hour and a half. We got through three God of Event stages. Got beaten on the fourth. Um, but that's just more content for me to come back and beat in future, and I'll come back with a vengeance. Um, I think he's back on New Year's. Fingers crossed. Um, it's whether we can get him with coins. It'd be part of the Tanabata banner. Um, I think it is, so that's where, like, AGL, UI, Goku, and in Evolution Blue Vegeta, who I will also be buying with, um, with red coins, that Vegeta, because I still don't have him. Um, yeah, I, I don't think I'll be summoning on that banner, because there's, like, 20 featured units. Um... If I can get him with coins, then it'd be between him and the Vegeta. I won't have coins for both. But yeah, I'll, I'll definitely be picking up one of them if I can. Um, but yeah, guys, I, I'm going to end the stream there. Thank you for tuning in. Brains, I know you're busy. Um, so definitely cheers for tuning in. If you do your Legends, if you do um, if you do your Legends stream, um, and I'm still awake, I'll definitely tune in and come check you out and support you as well. Um, for those of you that are still watching as well, Paragon is going to be doing a stream later, I think, where he's going to be taking on Corroded Body and Mind's mission of the GT Goku event. So if you still have that mission outstanding, um, or you want tips on team building with the Corroded Body and Mind's team, go check out Paragon's stream this evening. Um, yeah, he's really good with his team building, and he's quite intricate with how he goes against these enemies. So if you want tips on how to play the game and how to attack that particular mission, go do it. Um, again, guys, this is kind of my first proper stream run out with this layout. So if you do have any feedback or if you have anything like that, um, please let me know in the Discord. Because in the end, the only way I'm going to make this stream better for you guys to watch is if I get your feedback. Um, but again, if you like the video, please like, follow, sub, all of that good stuff. It means a lot. As you can see from the video, we're on a follow goal of 50. We're currently on 43. So literally seven away. Hopefully we can get there in the next week or so. Um... Zelda, dang, I got Evolution Vegeta with a duplicate. Don't rub it in. <laughs> I put so many stones into that Vegeta banner, I got shafted again. Um, but don't worry. Anyway, um, Paragon has been followed by Softball Brains. Oh, I love it. Every, everyone's following each other. Um, I put 900 into Vegeta. I think I put over a K into Vegeta. I saved up for so long. I got, go I got the Goku on my first rotation and then just put everything into Vegeta and I didn't get him. And then you got him on a single. What are you doing? What are you doing to me? No. <laughs> a fair, I mean, fair play to you, but oh, I put so many stones. It's it's just annoying, isn't it? It's annoying when you put like a thousand stones into, into it and someone gets him on a single. Ah. Oh. Um, I got MUI in a single. What is up with you guys? How does everyone get all these units for singles? Like, ah. Oh. Um, I. To be fair, I've said this is my last Gogeta summon, but I think um. I think it was Paragon that told me that uh, on JP they got a couple of tickets for uh, for this banner. On um, they get tickets on that banner as part of the part two missions, like the login missions or daily missions or something like that. Um, so I might do a couple of singles on that. So the Gogeta chase is still on, but just not looking very uh, very probable. Um, with the Vegeta animation no less than Brains was giving up. 
Um, let's see one more. I believe in you. Nah, I'm I'm not doing any summons. I'm I'm not doing any summons now. Um, I need I need to save stones for for Janemba. Janemba is where it's at. I don't. I, I said to Paragon, as I said in the um, Discord, I don't need Gogeta for any content, but I want him. I have massive FOMO, and he's just shiny and he's new, and I want him. Um, but I've done my summons now. Um, I'm not, I'm not going to spend any more. It's on to Janemba next. You can you can try and do the one more mentality on Janemba for me. <laughs> um, Paragon, now nah, it's it's from the Baronga. Dragon Balls uh, round two. Oh, so that's where you get those extra tickets from. Yeah, so I <laughs> say, so Paragon, if you have a question about the game, go to Paragon. He knows his stuff. <laughs> um, softball brains with a sad face. Sorry, man. I did the one more mentality when I first summoned for Gogeta, and I went from I, I went from spending 300 stones to spending 900. So um, I, I've, I've done, I've had my share on this banner. Um, I'll, I'll take my L. I'll go do my ticket summons next time. Um, if we get more tickets and we'll go from there. We've got to call it quits sometime. Yeah, we all, unless you like a whale, you can't get every unit. But, um, yeah. Um, I, I'm calling it quits on this banner. I'm probably going to call it quits on the stream as well. But as I said earlier, guys, thank you for tuning in. Um, it, it really does mean the world uh, and all the support. I say, go check out Brains' channel. He does a lot of Doken content. He also does a lot of Legends for the people that like Legends. Go check out Paragon and Zelda as well. They, From what I've seen, they both of them, they both do just focus on Dokum, but they are really good at what they do as well. Um, particularly Paragon, if you if you want to learn a bit more about Corroded Volume Mind, go watch his stream later on. Um, Zelda, a shoot, well, I need to get the rest of the Baronga Dragon Balls. Yeah, go get those done, man. It's free Kai, it's, it's free stuff at the end of the day. So go get those Dragon Balls done. It's, it's really not too hard. Um, but yeah, I'll end the stream there, guys. As I say, thank you for tuning in. If you have liked the content, please like, follow, sub. As I say, 43 out of 50. Seven more and we can reach the target. But yeah, thanks for all the support, guys. I will catch you in the next video. Have a great evening.